Today marks the latest chapter in the growth of our city in Harrisburg. I have long said construction is the surest sign of progress and the expansion of the South Bridge will allow Harrisburg to reach new heights. More than 125,000 vehicles cross this bridge every day. It is a lifeline that supports our economy and that of our neighbors on both sides of the Susquehanna River. Today also shows what good government is all about. This is a collaboration of multiple levels. Governor Shapiro calls it getting stuff done. And that is what and why it is my honor to welcome him to the podium. Thank you. Because of the secretary and the president being willing to listen to all of us here in Pennsylvania, especially our senior senator, Bob Casey, and our PennDOT secretary, Mike Carroll, I am now thrilled to be able to announce that the United States Department of Transportation has awarded the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania a half a billion dollars for the replacement of the I-83 bridge right here over the Susquehanna River. Now hear me on this. This is the largest federal grant for a single transportation project in Pennsylvania history. This is a big deal. And this is a sign of just how much the president cares about this community and cares about this commonwealth. You see, replacing this aging bridge will be transformational for this region and for all Pennsylvanians. This is a Pennsylvania project. It's a Pennsylvania, an entire state of Pennsylvania, 67 county priority. And we're grateful that we're gonna have uh, an investment in a bridge project that will bring jobs, a lot of good paying jobs, not just now, but in the future. Uh, it will help us transact business, move commerce, uh, keep our supply chains running. So, so many benefits, not just to the people of Dauphin and Cumberland County and South Central Pennsylvania as a region, but to our entire Commonwealth. My greatest uh, message about all of these projects, the 54,000 projects and counting that are getting support through the President's leadership and through this legislation, is that not a single one of them was invented, developed, or designed at the U.S. Department of Transportation headquarters in Navy Yard in Washington, D.C. Every one of them came from a community, a county, a state, looking for a better design. We have never believed that all the ideas were going to come from Washington, but we have always believed that more of the funding should, and now, at last, it is. So congratulations to this community, to Pennsylvania, to everybody who's going to be part of this great project.